Hi guys, in today's episode, I'm giving tips for Fall Guys Volley Fall, which I think is one of the hardest game uh, mini series that Fall Guys has to offer. So yeah, just getting right into a game and this one was definitely a back and forth, but I'm gonna show you a few tricks that allowed me to edge myself out versus my opponent. Um, one thing to start and notice is yellow always has the first possession or first ball. Um, and that's always good to know. And one thing I like to do is just immediately crowd the net and try and get one of those uh, long launches for it. And it worked to my advantage this time, getting a point. Um, here was doing well. One thing is to always face the ball when you're hitting it. I know that sounds counterintuitive, but you have to be in the direction there. Get a little unlucky, it bounces it off the net. Um, but if you're facing away from the ball, it's going to go in that direction. Here, I was able to get it nice, and it goes very far, but he's able to, to work really well, my opponent, and hit that um, up against the, the side banner, which he did to his fair play, to his advantage. Um, try and use that any way you can to get some misdirection. There, I think I'm a little bit unlucky, but it is what it is. Um, so I quickly try and make my opponent shift gears, and he wasn't able to deal with that. So it's tied up two to two. Um, and again, a little bit unlucky. I feel like that I was right underneath it and tried to get a good launch forward, but it is as it is. Here I do something really, really insightful. I face like I'm going one way, but then quickly turn and pivot the other way. And with that, I'm able to bring it back to another tight game. Crowding the net is something I don't recommend because all they need to do is just hit one long ball and there I play it off the back and then just I'm getting a little unlucky but the idea is just to keep incorporating bits of misdirection uh, so finally up one, four to three and yeah that's how she wrote that's how the game ends